do that later because the kids are gonna go with their other grandparents for the night um, like I said I work tomorrow so generally the weekends that I work well well yeah the, the weekends that I work um, they go with their other grandparents and um, with my nephew so they have a good time um, but yeah I got off work a little later than usual today. Um, I had some stuff to do before I left and before I actually closed. And um, the only reason I get excited for working Saturdays is because we generally always have menudo on Saturdays. So Saturdays means menudo and I'm so excited. I can't wait. <laughs> I'm such a fat kid. I just look forward to the food. But yeah. Apologize if the lighting isn't that great. It's been a super gloomy day, which I am loving. It's been raining on and off all day since last night, so I love it. I love the rain. I love the smell of the rain. I love the gloominess. But at the same time, it makes me just want to be at home in bed watching movies and not at work. You know, I just wasn't. I wasn't feeling work today. It was putting me. Not so much on a downer, but I was just like extremely tired and the gloominess was only making it that much worse. It's pretty usual, Janae woke up a lot throughout the night, so I hardly got any sleep, but it's all right. I'm hoping when she starts school, it'll like really tire her out and she'll sleep through the night. At least that's what I'm hoping for. We'll find out. 
I just try to enjoy them. They drive me crazy, don't get me wrong, but they're kids. <laughs> but I try to enjoy every bit that I can of them, so it's alright. switch lanes and then go super slow like don't get in front of me if you're gonna go super slow please take your ass somewhere else I get road rage guys but I only I noticed that my road rage here is a whole lot worse than it was in Kansas in Kansas it really wasn't that bad because people, I don't know, people just didn't piss me off with, the, with their driving over there. Maybe like twice out of the entire like year and a half that I was there. I can't wait to take these nails off. On Sunday I'll have had them for three weeks, but I'm going to take them off tomorrow night because I'm going to get my nails done again Sunday. I'm going to get them done early in the morning. So I'm anxious to take these off and get a new set because the girl that does my nails, she's one of my good friends and she does a bomb job and like these were some I had gotten done somewhere else but she tried to reshape them as best she could. I honestly think she did a really good job reshaping them and then she just, you know, did her thing so I can't wait to take these off and actually get like a brand new full set from her like it's genuinely her you know her work only because I just I love her nails she does amazing nails I remember when I was one of her guinea pigs when she first started doing nails and then like seeing her work now it's she's pretty amazing that's crazy I'll leave her Instagram down below that way if you guys want to like see her work if you're in El Paso and you want to check her out I will leave that in the description box because she's like I said she's pretty amazing what else I don't know why I keep talking with an accent guys I absolutely hate 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 being in traffic which I usually am not in this much traffic, so I guess like those 30 minutes that I like left later than usual made a difference because there's hella traffic right now and it's annoying. I swear traffic gives me like anxiety. I hate driving in traffic. Or I hate being in a store with like a ton of people. It, it, I don't know. I don't like it. I don't 
don't like it. I feel like watching the Kingsman movies this weekend. Oh, there's a rainbow! like an itch on my arm and I can't get to it because I have my jacket on so like when I scratch it it's only like a temporary fix because I, I didn't scratch it to my full potential <laughs> I know that sounds stupid but yeah I don't know the rainbow looks so pretty I haven't seen the sun all day and it's finally starting to peek out back there why? Might as well just stay gloomy for the rest of the day, you know what I mean? Like, so you know the sun's like beaming in behind me. He should have just stayed gloomy. El Paso weather sucks. Like, you could literally see all four seasons in one day. It's so annoying. It can be like super cold in the morning. And then you guys to see this rainbow if you can. See, look how pretty that is. It's so vibrant. Like, it's amazing. Gosh. There's for sure got to be a pot of gold at the end of that rainbow because I have never seen a rainbow that is that vibrant. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. I've seen rainbows, but they're like pretty, like, vague. That makes sense like they're very faint I've never seen a rainbow like that intense that's so crazy how funny on the oh sorry for the glare guys on the radio wow okay the sun is playing me right now anyway on the radio right now ironically yeah it's all bloody. Um, on the radio right now, they're talking about YouTubers and talking about how the person that was the highest paid made $22 million in one year. That's insane. And I think he said it was a little boy that was like a first grader or something like that. That's crazy. That's insane. I mean, I've said it in my past videos, I, um, the main reason I chose and had been wanting to do a YouTube channel was because I just generally, um, enjoy doing makeup, and I don't know, I, I mean, I'm not the greatest at it, by far, um, it's just something I enjoy doing, I have fun creating looks and getting out of my comfort zone and you know just I don't know it's it's something relaxing and fun for me so I thought you know I don't know I had just wanted to be wanted to do a YouTube channel for as long as I can remember and when I was living in Kansas I mean I finally had the courage to do it and I had the time to do it so I was like you know what why not it wasn't because of the money, because it could potentially, you know, be something I make money from. It was, you know, just for fun. Like, and I remember, like, when I would watch Nicole Guerrero's vlogs or Juicy Jazz vlogs. Like, I don't know. It just, it seemed like so much fun. So it's something that I wanted to do literally just for fun. I mean, that's why I do it. I'm like super on the edge today, but like I'm on the very edge. Ooh, it's cold. I'm like on the very edge of the driveway. Like here's the driveway and I'm literally like right up against the edge, but it's because sometimes my dad parks like a little more this way. So then I have to kind of scoot over because I don't want to be like too close to his truck. Because when we open the doors, like we hit each other. <laughs> 
I mean, not necessarily me, because I parked backwards, so my door's on the side where the rocks are. But, yeah. I can see the rainbow from here, too. I'm so fascinated by the rainbow, guys. But yeah, that has been um, my day, you know, just work, picking up Bubba from daycare, bringing him to my mom, my little girl wanting a unicorn cake. <laughs> Um, and then, yeah, like I said, I want to go to a store later. I'm, it's, I don't know, it's cold, but, and windy, but we'll see. Um, and then, yeah, my kids are going to leave later on. I don't, I'll probably drop them off here in a couple hours. Um, but yeah, that's been my day, guys. And then, you know, just went on my little rant of why I started YouTube. Um, but yeah, I don't know, I've been having fun doing my YouTube hasn't been anything big um but i i really you know had fun doing it and i enjoy making videos i wish i could make more videos than what i have been it's just really hard because since i am living with my parents right now um there's just a lot of commotion in the house so it's hard to do a talk through or even do the voiceover because there's just always noise in the background and I don't know like I don't know I'm sure it would bug some people that there's just so much noise in the background um, but I do want to try I don't know I want to try maybe doing videos and doing the voiceover maybe um, on the weekends when my kids aren't here or when they're asleep you know when it's kind of quieter in the house um, do those voiceovers but I do want to do more videos I want to do more of my makeup videos and I mean, I've, I've been coming up with different uh, video ideas just, you know, to have a variety of content. Um, I never wanted to just make it a beauty channel. That's why it's a beauty and lifestyle. Like, I want to throw random stuff in there. So I've been trying to come up with different ideas. But like I said, it's been a struggle, you know, just with um, all the noise. And then, I mean, I do work full time. So and I am a full-time mommy at the same time so you know it's 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 hard but I'm gonna try my best to do better that'll be my goal for this coming year um but yeah guys that's pretty much it I will if I don't see you guys later on when I go shopping um I will see you all tomorrow for vlogmas day eight I do work all day tomorrow but I will try to make it a decent vlog a good vlog I'll try my best <laughs> so if you guys are keeping up to date with me watching my vlogs I appreciate you guys it means the world to me um, so don't forget to subscribe and share like comment you know all that good jazz and yeah so I will see you guys tomorrow for vlogmas day 8 Bye.